divided into uh, two parts. Now, the first part is going to be my response to NASA saying that this glass dome right here that was in the news was a crater. So I'm going to show that it, it isn't a crater. This is a different frame with this glass dome in it. So we're getting a, a slightly different angle. And this makes it a little bit easier to show why this is a dome and not a crater. So we're gonna move actually to the glass dome itself. And because of this angle, you can see where the structure goes up. It's pretty obvious through here. And then the plate, the top plate is higher than the ground. Okay, we're gonna go back to this image, and this is another way to verify that this, this is a glass dome and not a crater, because this is a glass dome right here that is deteriorating and really is the same type of glass dome. So let's go and take a look at it, and you can tell, you can see the angle very clear through here and the top plate and a piece of the structure right here. And I want you to notice this, there's a, either a building or part of the support. And this thing has to be at least two miles high from the bottom of this uh, glass dome facility. And we'll get a clearer view. I just had to enlarge it and it did pixelate a little bit, but when we get to part two, uh, to look at the artifacts. I'll show this to you a little bit clearer. So the glass dome that I, that was featured in the news that I did, this right here proves and shows that it is a glass dome. Okay, we're gonna compare the two. There's the angle and the curvature, the plate, and the plate right here. Okay, now I'm gonna show you what a glass dome looks like when it's collapsed. Okay, um, in my other videos, if you've ever watched them, uh, I talk quite a bit on these structures, so you might want to go back and look at some of the videos and you'll get a better explanation on the reason that the uh, lunar surface looks the way it does. And of course, you can see where the uh, main frame had collapsed here and there's center frame here, this plate, which is held up by a column, which lifts this dome up. All this is collapsed and this is what a, a collapsed glass dome looks like. Okay, now we're, we're fixing to go into the area where I'm gonna show you where there's uh, deception over the same picture. And we're also gonna look at some artifacts that's never been seen before. This is the image that we were working with uh, earlier. And this is listed in, a, in the catalog as Messer A and B craters. But that's not correct because this is the actual Messer A and B uh, craters. And you notice these have collapsed. This one's partially deteriorated and this oval glass dome is still standing. And these are, are two different images, and this here is not this. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a look and we're gonna compare this glass dome here with this one. 
And as you notice, this one, you know, is partially deteriorated. We talked about this earlier. Of course, you have your uh, square building or support or wherever this uh, uh, structure is. And then over here you have uh, a structure that gave away. You can see pieces of here going forward. And it was built, I guess, apparently on the ground first and everything was built on top of it. So when it gave away, it, it pulled every, everything away from the, uh, it looks like a crater, and it folded this glass dome over. And then as you notice right in here, part of the structure has popped out. So it's, it's not the, they're not the same. They're listed the same, but they're not the same. So we're gonna go and we're gonna look at the oval glass domes and see if they match. And you notice they don't match and they have some similarities to them. This one looks a little bit wider, but remember uh, I told you that all these glass domes are built on glass walls on top of them. And this one here, uh, when it claps, it kind of mushroomed out. And that's the reason it, it looks a little bit wider and doesn't have the exact same shape. But there's some similarities here that make them the same as far as the structure. And here's a piece of structure that fell over this one here. And you notice it flares out and then you have a dark ground and that's part of whatever this was. Now in this one, this one collapsed on top of it, of this oval dome. And then over time, it collapsed and fell down the middle. And notice this has a skirt here too. So the pictures are the, the, uh, the images are almost the same. So you're gonna find on a lunar surface, you're gonna find a lot of round domes with the oval shaped dome bot. And there's, there's quite a few. Uh, I would think that one of the reasons that they call the Messer A and B uh, is because they have the exact similarities. And what they wanted to cover up was this. I don't know if you saw it earlier, but whatever fell and pulled this way, here's the structure here. And this is transparent metal. It's probably transparent titanium through here. And it, it looks like a cat's face. It's, it's definitely a face of something. Now, to confirm this, let's take a second look so you can get a, a second a second type of uh, look at it. Uh, this is more shadowy, and you can see a little bit more of the images in it. So there definitely is, here's that skirt, you can see it better, and then you can see this image. So this is from Messer A and B Crater, and look at the similarities. There's a, a face, right here, like for decoration, and there's a face here. So even the two faces are different. So what they're, what they're doing is, if somebody was to see this or see this on other images, they would think that they were looking at Messer A and B craters. Okay, everyone, thanks for watching. And I will see you on the next video.